guys, welcome to another video from me. Today I'm going shopping. I'm going to get Isla and Ren's stocking fillers and I'm going to try and keep to under £20 each. Um, it's just stocking fillers and I want to get some fun things. My cat is stuck in the wardrobe. <laughs> Honey, here she comes. <laughs> Come on then. She will definitely jump down in about two minutes. Um, here she comes. <laughs> um, so yes, I'm going to go to B&M, Home Bargains, all the kind of usual places that we love and see if I can get some nice little goodies for under £20. Um, so that is my maximum budget, maximum budget £20 each and I will take you with me and then once I'm all done, I will film so you can see what's in each other's stockings. Little Ren still doesn't have a stocking, so I'm going to have to pick him up one when I'm out. And I've totally forgot what theme we go. Every year we do a different theme and I have white and I have red. So I think, I think last year we were red, but I need to double check. So I'll pick him up a little stocking as well. So yeah, let's get going. Oh my goodness, guys. Tell me you're a mum without telling me. I'll go first. <laughs> mm. I am so hungry. So the last video I done was 11 o'clock this morning. It is now 20 to 1 <laughs> and I still haven't eaten a thing. Um, Rent is now snoozing in the car so food on the go. Usually I definitely would just do a McDonald's run but we go on honeymoon in one week and I'm just trying to eat better to be honest um so yeah we're having a pot noodle soba noodles in the car we have arrived I can see the sign um so hopefully I'll finish this and he will have had about half an hour nap um and we can head in and he won't be crabbit or all going well I can move him into his pram um and he'll still be asleep so we will see um, also, how annoying, this honestly, is it riles me completely, but I've just arrived and there is like nine, in fact probably even more than that, there's probably about 12 disabled spaces here and there is three parent and child, three parent and child. So the car park is tiny and I have quite a big car and it's really difficult getting rain in and out of the car as is. So I've drove about waiting on a parent and child space and it was an old couple who were in a disabled space. No children whatsoever and there is currently six disabled spaces free and they're in a parent and child. It riles me up so much. I wish I could just get out and say, can you move? I have a child that needs to get out in and out the car and you are in a space that I need. And I don't think I can park in a disabled space if there's no children, parent and children spaces. So yeah riles me right up anyway positive vibes we have arrived and i am just about to go in <sighs> do you know what i wish i could take a trolley but i'm gonna have to push the pram so how exciting i'll see you soon here we go look who's awake oh my goodness i want every one of these These are only a pound and these are fab for if you're going travelling because you can obviously pop your little bobbles in there and um, they're good for holidays and yeah, little staycations. Loads of bobbles and loads of hair accessories. I love, would love all of these.
Hey guys, so I am now home and in total I spent £40.40 and, 40 pence. and I have both my bags here. This one is Wren's and this one is Isla's. And I'll quickly go through them and show you what I managed to get. So I'll start off with, in fact, I'll just go through the bags and I'll be able to tell you whether it was B&M or Home Bargains. Majority, to be fair, was from B&M. Um, I just picked up a couple of things for Ren and I'm sure a little colouring book. But let's go through it and I'll show you everything I got. So starting with Ren's bag. So he is currently eight months. Um, so by Christmas he will be just short of nine months, um, literally by about a week. Um, so still a little too. So I wanted to get him a lot of kind of sensory things and things that he can play with. He does play with a lot of Isla's books at the moment and are kind of just our general toys. So first thing was I picked him up a little That's Not My Kangaroo book. Love these books. Isla had them well, she had so many when she was little and I just thought it was quite cute for him to read through um, all the wee scratchy bits um, and yeah it's a nice book for him to read so that was £2.99 then next up was this My Remote Control so this is £5 I mean you probably could give this as a gift but there wasn't a lot to choose from, so um, yeah, I seen this and I thought, it's £5, that's alright. And also push all the little buttons and it makes all the different noises, lights up. Cute! So, £5. Then I got him these little socks. So these are from Home Bargains, these were one ninety nine. They are Christmas, obviously, so I might end up putting these in his little Christmas Eve box. In fact, I probably will. Um, but even after Christmas, how cute are those? He can... He's obsessed with his feet just now as well. Yes! Can you come in? Not yet! Stay out just now! I'll be five more minutes! Good girl! <laughs> I'm really trying to do this as quickly as possible. So yes, those are £1.99 from Home Bargains. Also from Home Bargains, this wind up little bath toy. This is £1.29. And you can see on the back they actually have loads of different ones. Um, but this is the only one left on the shelf. So for £1.29, he will have so much fun with that in the bath. I'm not a fan of the little squirters that they have because I just feel like they gather so much bacteria. So anything like this is super cute. You can use it for even a short time, it's a pound. Then back to B&M, this little ball, um, a little sensory ball, £2, flashies, lots of different colours and yeah, that's what they love at that age isn't it, so for £2. They had different ones as well but it has a lot of the the basic kind of round spike ones with lights in them anyway so thought that was a bit different for them. Then home bargains we're back over at home bargains now for the rest of the things this was 1.99 it's a little windmill and when you push it yeah Ren is going to love this <laughs> um so we do a lot of different things with sensory i would probably make a little tent with this and then put this inside obviously it's more adult supervision because it can be quite dangerous but just more for sensory the lights etc i thought he would he would love that for 1.99 so that as well then this also home bargains a little teething ring a safari one this was 2 dollars um, it's a Fisher Price one it's good to have either in the car and he's changing bag or just something new for his little basket but as we are in prime time for teething just now I thought that would be fabulous and then finally just finishing off with a little gingerbread tin these actually have gingerbread biscuits in them but i'm going to just change these over for some biscotti biscuits which he is loving at the moment and yeah it's a little treat tin for him as well and it means he's not missing out how adorable so that is all his and in total his came to 19 pound and 24 pence which I'm so proud of because I actually didn't even count as I was going but I knew roughly what I was at so 
so proud of that. Then we move on to Isla's. Five more minutes. Okay. I'll come and get you. You're the best. What a doll. Okay, Isla's. So, this is so exciting. I love, she's at the prime age just now. So she, is... are you in your room? Good girl. So she has just turned three years old and she is honestly a mini version of me. It's the cutest thing ever. So it's fun. It's so fun buying for her. So we will start off, this bag is kind of mixed, so we'll just go for it. Starting with B&M, um, the first thing I got her was this frozen toothbrush. So I have an electric toothbrush and she currently has just a little manual one. Um, okay. Yep. I have a for you. Thank you so much. You are the best. I will be through it in five minutes, okay? Okay. Good girl. What am I doing? Anyway. So, yes, this frozen toothbrush. So, she is obsessed with frozen just now. And, yeah, like I say, I have an electric toothbrush. So, I think she'll love using this. Um, and I am I am that mum. But I also bought her <laughs> toothpaste. <laughs> because she needs toothpaste. Um... But the reason I bought it is because it matches with her toothbrush. So yeah, it's a little a little gift. <laughs> um so yeah, got the um, that toothpaste was a pound and the toothbrush was three ninety nine for an electric toothbrush. I think that's quite good. Then I also picked her up these from B and M. So these little mini lip balms. Um they did have a few like girly lip glosses, but lip glosses are just too stressful for me. I feel like she gets sticky like all the time. She gets them in her hair whereas the lip balms aren't too bad and these ones are all different flavours. So we have grape, apple, cherry and orange and then a little balm tin, tin in the middle. Um, so how cute is that? I find that really exciting. They are £4. What I would say is when I went into Home Bargains they had exact same so there was chuppa chups and swizzles and they actually had five lip balms and they were only three pounds so definitely shop around um i've seen these and picked them up so i'm not going to go crazy over a pound but yeah they had they had more on offer in home bargains for cheaper then also in b&m i picked her up this yes what are you doing? I'm only going to be five more minutes and I'll come and get you and we can go make some hot chocolate. I've made my bed and I've put the water back on and i put them over. Well done, you're the best. Santa is definitely going to come and visit you. So, as I was saying, I um, picked up this putty, um, which I hate so much. But she, we were at a, a festival thing before and Ayla seen these. Isla got one of these in one of her little gift bag things and she loved it so much. So it was only £2.50. You mix the glitter and the rainbow sequence thing at the top. Mix it all in. It'll probably last her one time, but it's £2.50 and I know she's going to love it. So yeah, that's well. Then picked up this little lolly. This is 89 pence. It had a little reindeer and they had santa as well um and then it has white chocolate ones 89 pence nice to add in she was going to get so many sweets so i'm not stressing about that too much also from b&m is this little honeybee so we have the sylvanian families um i made her a doll's house last year while we renovated it and i bought her the bunny rabbits sylvanian family family and um i seen this on offer so this was six pound down to three pound in b&m just now and I thought it was quite a nice one just to add in as a little extra. She can play with them in her little house. So yeah, for three pound bargain. Then I also, this is home bargain. So this is the same as Ren's Little Gingerbread Man, but this is a fairy. This is filled with chocolate coins. So I probably won't change this to be honest, but this is only 99 pence, um, which is fantastic. Then this bath string, sorry, I'm hurrying up now because I can hear them getting a bit annoyed. This bath spaghetti soap, um, this was from Home Bargains and it was £1.79. How fun is this going to be? We're currently in the middle of loving bath foam, bath fizzers. So something different, something exciting. And you know what, Ren will probably love that as well. It's from b &M. It's unicorn pyjamas for £4. Love these little jammies. 
Then finally, from Home Bargains, you basically, the little stickers, you can design or change all the dresses on the little fairies. Again, Isla is going to absolutely love this for 79 pence. Cannot grumble. So in total, hers came to £21.16. And, si <laughs> and 16 pence. Yes, I am done. done I am done. Want to come and play now? Ah, I will see you next time.